fuck. Fuck a ducky, indeed. Mm. So, um, Ramu Tet. You can... Ramu Tet. It is, as you said, the only fucking black. I. Um, what it is, or what, what we're reiterating, really <gasps> is the fact that Teresa's got it. <laughs> it's only been whatever, but anyway, now is the only moment. So what it is, is Teresa for a while has been trying this and trying that and what is, and finally she stopped trying and just decided to sit in the bliss of Ramu Tet. And from there. And bang, bang. everything. <laughs> oh. It was easy. It was easy. It's like I think this also has a lot to do with the work that we've been doing with reclaiming the cosmology. Yeah, right. Which helped sitting in um, well, Ramu Tet well, a little bit more. I think it really helped that progress to that. But when I fully committed to just sitting in Ramu Tet and nothing else, that's when everything happened. That's it's when like everything saying, opened. What is Ramu Tet? Would you like to say what Ramu Tet is? <laughs> now she's on the <laughs> spot. Fuck off. No, it's not even. It's just like it's. Oh, well, well, Ramu Tet is just merging with Mu and Ra and igniting that soul star and just sitting in that absoluteness of that frequency. Um, but it's like a fucking everything orgasm, honestly. It's just... I mean, if this is how you got to go out, let's do it, right? Yeah, absolutely. I like, I can... I, my hedonism perhaps makes all my practices have bliss. <laughs> You know, I just don't see why you do anything that isn't blissful. I don't see why you would do anything that doesn't make you feel better. Yeah, I know. I'm not into that torturous shit. So, yeah, we're looking at Ramu Tet as in sitting in essence. And when you're in essence, you bring the energy up from Mu and you bring the energy down or you activate the Ra codes within. And as it hits that essence, it helps the embodiment for sure. But it ignites that soul star and in that bliss, that everything, everything's open to you, yourself, Mu, etc. But then you've got the added bonus of dragon. So dragon burns up any and all of the bullshit that's not in alignment with this bliss. Mm -hmm. So when you want to work on something, you don't have to go in there going, oh, I'm going to work now on my... <laughs> Abundance, or whatever the fuck it is, right? So it's all about, you know, you've had that idea out here in the fuckery world. When you go mm. in, you just motherfucking bliss out at knowing that that's going to happen and that's all you need mm -hmm. to do. I mean, Jesus, yeah. Mary Joseph, few rock and tunes, yeah. Yeah. It's, <laughs> I really, really got how you can bust the bullshit in bliss. Like you really can, just like you can have orgasmic birth. It doesn't have to be, you know, this horrible thing, this hardworking thing that I've always thought that it was, you know. Even my head was Buffer. like, yeah, Buffer. it's a Catholic thing. I don't know, but it's like it was always ingrained in me. no gain. Yeah, but the essence is all about the bliss. Ramu Ted is all about the bliss. It's like... <laughs> You don't, you don't have to wade through this shit. You don't even have to think of this shit. You just sit in it and let it do its thing. No, but exact, exact. How do I get rid of shit? I just go into bliss. All righty then. You know? And the thing it's is, what it, is. is it, it stays with you. It's not a momentary thing. Like we've said before with this work, the more you do it, it builds. Each time it builds and builds and builds. So that bliss becomes your bottom line rather than just a, something you strive for. That becomes your status. That becomes where you're emanating from. And, you know, life's just not that much harder. It's easier. It's it, For me, the mystery has come back, like the magical mystery in the sense that what's Essence doing now? What have we got going on? And even when some fucker is there, it's kind of like, essence? <laughs> you know? It's, it's, it's so true. But to be clear, essence is not higher self. Essence is not something outside of you. Essence has a capital E. It's a proper noun. It's describing you, 
all the way back to source. All your incarnations, all your experiences, you all the way back to source. Clarity.